how are you? Welcome to my channel. My name is Imani and I make videos about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and speech pathology. I am super excited because I went on Pretty Little Thing and purchased a few outfits to go out. I am celebrating my last and final semester within the Speech at NYU program. I am so excited, guys. Like, oh, oh my god! Wow! I'm ready to celebrate and I need you guys help in picking an outfit. So if you guys want to help me out in choosing an outfit out of the three that I purchased, then continue to watch this video. Also, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and um, subscribe as well because I'm going to be cranking out some more of these types of videos and if you like it, I would really like to know. So let's get started. Okay y'all, so I wanna talk about the outfits, each one really quickly to give you a quick debrief. By the way, this is not sponsored at all whatsoever. I brought this all with my own money, so just so you guys know. Okay, so the first outfit that I tried on today was a corset dress. This dress had like a satin top and it was tight at the bottom, almost like bodycon at the bottom. It came like mid thigh. I like the dress because it gave me a really really like authentic 90s feel and I felt like I would have to wear literally the most minimal makeup, the most minimal accessories and the dress would speak for itself. Um, I also brought a pair of shoes that I can show you guys later that I wanted to pair with all of the dresses. So um, yeah, this dress was brought in a size 8 and as you can see from the top, it was too big so it was like flopping a little bit on the top. Um, the actual, what do you call it? Like the straps of the dress, they were not adjustable so um, it was just way too big and I wasn't able to change that which was kind of annoying. And um, you can tell from the back, it like hung really, really low in the back. So it was too big on the top and tighter on the bottom, which is something that happens sometimes, most of the time when I buy things. So um, I really, really need to try on first, but Pretty Little Thing was a little bit of an experiment for that reason. But anyway, the stress did not seem to really fit me that well. So I don't know, I wanna hear what you guys think about it. Um, so let me know if you like number one in the comments. Okay, dress number two is also black. You see the black theme going on here. Don't ask, I don't know. I don't know, I was just thinking black. But um, this was a cut out one shoulder dress and I really, really liked how dramatic the cutout was. Um, if you can see on the right side of the dress, it was like cinched in. So it really made the cutout even more dramatic, even more, it stood out even more and it was so cute. Um, I really liked this dress and I could picture it with like really bold gold accessories. So not even like, something bolder than this, like a door knocker earring or like something just really, really bold with this dress because it just gave me that like glam, like, I don't know, gave me this glam feel, something I was really going for. The only thing with this dress is again, I got it in a size eight and I noticed that the top was a little bit big. The bottom also was a little bit big and it almost gave like a trash can look. Like if you, I mean a trash bag look, not trash can. If you look at it, I don't know if I'm bugging, <clears throat> but to me, it gave a little bit of a trash bag look. Let me know what you guys think about this one because I love the cutout in the dress and I almost just want to wear it for that reason. But I do realize it, it, I don't know if the fit was right, but let me know what you guys think. I think it's a beautiful dress with a pair of black heels and like I said, those really chunky accessories. So, we'll see. Okay, the next outfit is this bardo dress. Now, bardo is referencing the top of the dress and how it's off the shoulder. Um, and it has that like scrunchy look to the top of it. That's what bardo means, but it's a bodycon bardo dress. It's also pleated at the bottom. So, I absolutely love this dress. I think this is my favorite. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, it is adorable, number one. It gives me all the 90s vibes, but it also is just like, 
cute but like sexy cute so I can totally see this working um, with the black heels as well I think it would be so adorable to wear and I really like the way the dress hugged my curves it had that really easy zip in the back so that it stayed tight it stayed on the only thing I could say about this dress is I could have gotten it maybe a size smaller maybe maybe but I think that it's perfect and um, this is definitely one of my favorites. Oh, and just to mention as well, I did have on shapewear with each of the dresses. The next outfit that I tried on, so the jacket was from Zara. That is a Zara jacket. It is not a um, Pretty Little Thing blazer jacket. And the only thing that was from Pretty Little Thing was the little insert that I wore underneath. So the little bandeau, it's actually a slinky bandeau, they called it. And I can see it paired with a pair of black slacks a skirt, um, I don't know, there's so many different ways that I can wear this. I was wearing biker shorts as well, but the biker shorts are not a part of the outfit, even though that's not a bad look. With some black heels, honestly I could see that working, but let me show you guys the black heels that I keep thinking of and talking about. So I purchased these black heels from Forever 21 at the beginning of the summer and I love these. Like, If you guys need like inspo for shoes and stuff, I actually got the idea of going to Forever 21 from a blogger. Her blog is High Low Lux. She's here on YouTube, she's also on Instagram and she does a lot of fashion videos. I love her fashion videos because she talks about like higher end pieces but she mixes them with lower end pieces and she has a pair of forever 21 heels that she swears by i wasn't able to find those but i like these even better so, so these heels i purchased from pretty little thing and they have the strap that go up onto the ankle i can insert a picture here just so you guys can see the look but um this strap here goes onto the ankle it has that clear heel, it's nude throughout, and you probably can't see it, but that clear strap at the front. So I think that these shoes are so on trend, so cute, I could wear them a lot. The only thing is when I tried them on, number one, they were a little big. So these are a size 39. Well, that's why they're clicking. What's not clicking? There's but the other reason why I didn't really like these and I'm returning these is because they're it's too high. If you have a pair of clear heels that you love, please let me know because I am on the hunt for a pair and um, I really, really want to find a nice affordable pair of clear heels that I can actually walk in. So let me know if you have the plug. So the last little accessory that I wanted to share with you guys that I think would go perfectly with these outfits is this little, tiny, cutesy pretend Kelly bag. This is like a little play on the Hermes Kelly and I think it's so cute. Um, they're really on trend right now, these mini micro bags. And as you could see in one of the clips where I was wearing that dress, and I put this bag on with it, oh my god, so cute. I think it goes with everything because it's black it's patent so it like upgrades the look and the gold detail is like really gold so it's that rich pretty gold it's not muted and it'll go with all your jewelry so i think this is adorable the last thing i want to share with you guys is an accessory it is also from pretty little thing and it's a pair of earrings so i got these they were on sale and i thought they were so super cute and dainty. I'll put one in just so you guys can see. So here are the earrings. They're so cute and so dainty and I feel like they could really go with a lot of stuff so Alright guys, I want to thank you so much for tuning into this video. I had a lot of fun filming. If you liked it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe, tell a friend about my channel, and I will continue to make these types of videos. Don't forget to leave a comment down below to let me know which outfit that you liked the best. Thank you. See you guys in my next one. Bye.